97-year-old Jyoti Pillay has put his life story to print. It's important for the family to know where they come from. It includes all the twists and turns of a life that has taken him from Mauritius to apartheid South Africa and finally to London. But it's not destined for a bestsellers list. Inspired by questions from his granddaughter about his past, the Pillay family employed a biography service to write his memoirs so they can be passed down to future generations. This is a copy of their book. It's 74 pages long. Getting it written and published cost just over $2,500 and took a little over a month to complete. Now, Biography Services offering to write people's memoirs like these have seen an increase in customer demand since the pandemic began. So they're friends that you've known for over 50 years? Rebecca is a professional ghostwriter with Story Terrace, a company that pens biographies for ordinary people. She'll spend up to 10 hours interviewing a client, learning their story and getting a feel for their voice before she starts to write. Demand for her services has increased since the pandemic began. I think Covid has, has made people really confront their own mortality and the mortality of their loved ones and the people around them so it sort of feels more pertinent more than ever than um, actually sitting down and doing it and investing in um, somebody to sort of take that off their hands and do it in a matter of months. For this personal biography service Story Terrace charges between $2,000 and $7,000 and its revenues more than doubled to over five million dollars in the four months after the UK locked down in March. It's been very good. We have grown over 400% since last year uh, in the UK and um, yeah, that's continuing that trend. As the saying goes, everyone has a story to tell. And for Jyoti Pillay and many others like him, biography services have given them an opportunity to get theirs into the history books. Natalie Powell, London.